Hey everybody, it's me, Bayzad, and today I've got a very interesting pair of jeans to show off, the turmeric selvage, and I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about them. Most people today, when they think turmeric, they think food, they think Indian cuisine, they think a healthy ginger turmeric smoothie, but turmeric dyeing has actually been around for centuries. Now, some people say turmeric dyes have health and healing properties, and I'm not sure about any of that stuff. We're not trying to make any kind of medical claims here, but if that is you know, the kind of thing you're interested in, you can find a bunch of articles about it online. Anyways, for me, turmeric dyes didn't show up on my radar until a few years ago when one of our staff members was doing some home turmeric dyeing and showed me the stuff they were working on. It looked pretty incredible. It produced such a beautiful and warm golden color that I knew we had to use these for jeans. We love using natural dyes, especially when they're a little bit unexpected. In the past, we've done green tea, we've done wine, we've done coffee, we've done blueberry and, and strawberry dyed shirts, we've done a persimmon, a Japanese kakishibu dye, and of course, we've used plenty of natural indigo. Natural dyes are derived from organic materials like plants, fruits, vegetables, and roots. And in this case, we're using the root of the turmeric plant. I think natural dyes pair really well with denim, mostly because of the way they work. They tend to produce a very inconsistent color and they'll fade over time with age. When it comes to raw denim, a fabric that you want to age and fade over time, having a natural dye that also fades and ages with time adds a little bit of extra spice to the fabric, uh, if you know what I mean. Uh, Anyways, that's a bad joke. Uh, it, adds, uh, it adds some character to the fabric, so, uh, so yeah. Let's take a closer look at the turmeric selvage. The turmeric selvage is a 12 ounce Japanese selvage denim with an indigo dyed warp that has a subtle neppy and hairy texture. You'll also notice the golden glow that shows through the twill lines, which is a result of the turmeric dyed weft interior. You can really see how the weft shines through here compared to a classic indigo by white raw denim. On the back, you'll notice this brown rough out suede leather patch, which I think is a beautiful pairing for this denim. You've got contrast stitching as well as our custom made antique copper buttons and rivets. These are all made by YKK in the USA. Taking a look inside the jeans, you'll reveal the warm turmeric colored weft and you'll also notice the pink line selvage ID. I think the turmeric selvage works well in the fall since we're wearing a lot of warm colors. And if you're into boots, these are gonna pair especially well with warm toned leathers. The fabric has that classic raw denim look and feel. They are quite rigid and will take a couple of days to break in to be comfortable. The turmeric selvage will be available in the Super Guy, Weird Guy and Easy Guy fits. Check out the blog post linked in the description for more photos as well as a complete listing of retailer availability. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. You can also join me here live on YouTube Friday evenings at 7 p.m. Eastern for our weekly live stream. I answer your questions and give you all the naked and famous denim news that you can use. Let me know your thoughts about the turmeric selvage in the comment section below and let me know what kind of natural dyes would you like to see from us in the future. Let's uh, continue the conversation down there. Um, I think that's everything. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.